blog make sure to give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion beauty lifestyle and travel videos all right you guys I have gotten myself together this morning because I'm heading to an event it's a skincare event should be really fun it's at um, one of the best like restaurants here on Miami Beach Casa Tua and it is a skincare class with Tata Harper I've actually never heard of the brand so I'm interested to get to know more about it you guys know I'm on my skincare zoom so that should be really fun but before we get dressed and head there I wanted to show you all some new end pieces that I have from Veronica Beard and this portion of the video is in partnership with Veronica Beard the clothes are amazing you guys and they have some really wonderful dresses for the holiday season so I'm gonna show you guys a few of the pieces that they sent over for me um, I'm going to style them for you all and of course I'm going to link a few of my favorites down below in the description bar. So let's head into the room, let's do a quick holiday haul from Veronica Beard and then we'll get ourselves together and head to the event. Alright you guys, so I have two stunning dresses in from Veronica Beard. We're going to start with this one. Uh, this is a beautiful silk dress. The shape of this dress, it doesn't look like much on the hanger. But on the body, it looks fantastic. It is a midi dress. It has a center seam and beautiful ruching. So it gives you kind of like this hourglass figure. The material is, uh, it feels so silky and smooth on your skin. Um, there's a hidden zipper here in the back. And then the upper back portion is actually pretty open with um, a button closure. And a little clasp here too, if you want to keep that closed. But yeah, for the most part, it's an open back. And there is no slit, but oh, this is so gorgeous. I think this is the perfect dress for the holiday season. Uh, this like ox blood, deep, deep, like burgundy is a really great color for the holidays. And I ended up styling this with my new bag from Rebag because they are literally the same color. And it just worked out. <laughs> so perfectly so in this dress i went with a size six a us size six and the six fits perfectly it does have a tiny tiny bit of stretch but i will go with your normal size in this dress um and i'll be sure to link this dress down below it's so beautiful and just like sophisticated and chic with your hair up in like a little chignon or a French roll and this, ugh, you can't tell me anything, okay? Perfect for a holiday party. Now, for the next dress, this is a little bit more dressier, so if you're having like a holiday party, um, either at your job or with friends, or maybe you're going to the ballet or something really cool like that. I'm actually going to the ballet soon, so I'm thinking of wearing this dress. Uh, so this one is so beautiful. It's almost like a crushed, velvet and it's green but it has hints of gold and it is a halter top let me put these up so you guys can see more of the shape of the front of it oh so this little portion goes around your neck and then there are three little buttons here in the back but can you just see this material it's so gorgeous it's so gorgeous okay this dress i also got in a size six so it halters around the neck there's a hidden zipper here on the side and there is no slit it's just super long and gorgeous this is more like a maxi dress whereas this one is more of a midi dress 
but like get into the colors and the fabrics and the shine and the sheen it's so good for the holiday season uh so yeah those are the two dresses from veronica beard if you're looking for anything for the holidays just check it out i will also link a few more of my favorite dresses from veronica beard down below and i love these little hangers like that's such a cool touch and i'm sure that these hangers are recyclable as well so those are the two pieces in from veronica beard and i did go to the miami design district and i shot both of these looks so what I'll do now is insert that so you can see how the dresses move, how they fit, how you can move in them, uh, and we'll come back and we'll talk about it. So let's go ahead and roll that beautiful bean footage. day with Maria and we had so much fun I do like to bring you guys a lot of holiday content especially around November because I know you all are on the hunt for the perfect holiday dresses Christmas Thanksgiving New Year's and so these are at an excellent price point and they're just beautiful dresses so I'll be sure to link both dresses down below again shout out to veronica beer for partnering with me on this portion of the video and for gifting me these gorgeous gorgeous dresses i'm definitely thinking about wearing this one when i go to the ballet um I, i'll be in new york in a few weeks and i'll be going to the ballet you guys of course i'm going to take y'all with me but i think this is the dress i'm going to wear because it's stunning again i ended up pairing this one with my dior bag and I believe my gold Tom Ford sandals. Um, and this one, I honestly can't even remember what I paired this with. But anything I styled these two outfits with will also be linked down below. So yeah, thanks so much to Veronica Beard. And again, I will link a few more of my favorites, including these two, in the, in the description box. Alright you guys, so I have about 15 minutes to get myself together. Um, I don't even know what I'm going to wear today, but we're going to figure it out. By the way, Skims house dress, always and forever. Love these dresses. They're, they're just so good. Um, yeah, I still have my hair. I like cr pin curled it earlier today, but y'all, the curls in this hair do not last. Okay. I don't know if it's the hair. I don't know if it's the, the humidity in Miami or if it's just me, but if you have any tips for how to get your hair to hold a curl that doesn't include uh tons and tons and tons of hairspray or you have a hairspray that just works every time for kinky straight hair please drop it down below in the comments because i need help okay i need all the help i can get because i'm ready to take this out <laughs> because it's just been a little difficult um okay i want to look cute but i want to be comfortable because it's just a lunch so I'm thinking I might wear a pant, either a pant or a dress. And you guys know, I always go for like an easy breezy dress. So maybe we'll do that. 
Um, I'll check back in when I'm dressed and ready and then we will head to Casa Tua for the Tata Harper skincare event. All right, guys, I got myself together, put my hair up into a little ponytail. For the top, I went with this Zara bodysuit. I love the little mock neck and the, the arches here. It's very cool. The bag, Fendi. The skirt is actually new in, and my girl Karen of Karen Britchick sent this skirt over. This is from her upcoming amazon the drop collection okay i'm not sure when it's going to come out but i absolutely love it it is like a cargo skirt with cargo pockets and really cool buttons and i just think it's so fresh and fun and i've never seen anything like this from the drop but karen did that and i love it i'm wearing it in a size small let me show it to you guys okay so here is the cargo skirt she also made these in cargo pants as well. I also believe this comes with a matching top, which I do have. Um, but I love the little pockets. It has an elastic waist. And the bottom is actually like a scoop neck. If you can kind of see, it goes lower than the front. And then we have this asymmetrical element where you can button just one button or both. And a little pocket there. It's pretty cool. I really, really love it. And it's very chic. And I paired it with my Chanel Pearl Mules because I just wanted to do a classic, elegant look today. And my Fendi Baguette, which I don't wear enough. It's the Fendi Zuka print. For the earrings, I went with my Oscar de la Renta gold earrings. And on the lip, I have Dior Rose Glow Oil in the color Rosemary. So that is the look for today's event. Let's head out. Oh, I do wanna show you all my new favorite uh, perfume combination because both of these are very affordable. I just got the Zara Gold Perfume and it just smells so good. This is $19.90 at Zara. It's fun, it's flirty. It smells amazing. It smells very similar to MFK, um, Gentle Fluidity Gold. And then, of course, my Jennifer Lopez Promise. I, I, I promise you guys, every time I wear this, people go nuts for this. Like, people love this fragrance. And a lot of you have gotten it and said that you love it as well. So this is very affordable, the Jennifer Lopez Promise. As you can see, I love it because there is hardly any left in here. Um, so I'm going to have to get a new bottle. But yes, this this fragrance is a match made in heaven you guys will love it both of these super affordable i believe you can probably get both of these for a total of about 60 or 70 bucks all right so i'll link both of these down below and let's go
few hours since uh, the Tata Harper event, but that was super fun. It was at Casa Tua, which is a really cool like little restaurant. They also have like a membership there. Um, I would love to go back for dinner one night or one day. Uh, but it was great we got to experience the entire line the cleansers the essences the exfoliators um and it was great like my skin was glowing <laughs> after using it but i wish i would have known that that's what we were doing because i wouldn't have spent time doing my makeup um but yeah super fun we also got a gift bag of items so i'll go over that with you guys tomorrow today has been so hectic i woke up i did a workout uh i did a ton of work i went to that event i came back i did more work i've been filming all day um i have a reel to get up for mugler for their angel elixir fragrance one of my favorites it smells great i think i might actually wear it tonight for this event um yeah your girl is tired like this is the busy season and i don't want to complain because lord knows i'm blessed to have so many opportunities and events and things but quarter four is go time and i'm looking forward to january so i can relax <laughs> so i got myself together i put on this gray sweater from zara i love it underneath everyone has been asking about this bra because i did a reel in it it's from urban outfitters it's super old if i can find it i'll link it i put on my norma kamali skirt from my Teresa, i love this skirt and it's very affordable too I, I believe it might even be on sale for the shoes i went with my uh, Saint Laurent mesh pumps, one of my favorite heels. And for the bag, we're going with my Saint Laurent clutch that I got while I was in Paris, um, secondhand at Printemps. On the top floor, they have a like luxury designer consignment shop, and I found this, which is great. So that's the look. A little fancy on my lip. Oh, I just realized I don't have my earrings. Um, I'm feeling gold today, but you guys, I think I left my gold Saint Laurent earrings in, in New York. Why would I do that? So now I need to figure out like a hoop situation. Maybe we'll go for these. Why are these all intertwined? Ugh. Maybe we'll go for these. Cool little earrings from Pescanoni or something like that I can't remember y'all these I've had them for quite some time um I'm gonna spray on a little bit of the Mugler Angel Elixir it smells so good I've been spraying it because I've been creating that content in fact I'll go ahead and pop that reel up for you guys you could watch it and I'll be right back okay super cute right um this is the bottle it's so cool and it just has all of the like fragrances like notes in it that i love like um pink pepper vanilla like wood gourmand it's a very nighttime fragrance very like sexy dark mysterious like who's that girl type of fragrance and of course i love this refillable star bottle uh so that's the look for tonight we are going to head out ria is going to be our plus one and yeah Let's go to LC. Oh, did I tell you guys where I'm going? I don't think I did. I'm heading to El Cielo again at the SLS South Beach because their Michelin star chef is having like a little shindig. There are going to be cocktails and pass bites and it'll just be a fun event. I need to go put my jewelry on. I took everything off. All right, let's go. All right, guys, hopefully you are able to see me, but Zara sweater, um, I'll link the earrings because I can't remember. The lip is Fenty MVP. Uh, the bag, Saint Laurent. The shoes, Saint Laurent as well. And this super cute skirt is from Norma Kamali from My Teresa. And I'm wearing a medium. I believe before I paired this with the Norma Kamali bodysuit body in like a butter pecan color. Um, but yeah, I wanted something a little more dressy yet pare it down because this is like a cocktail hour you know so yeah i'm loving the look hair the curls are on fleek and we are ready for tonight
morning guys so my hairstylist sorry i'm looking crazy i'm in the middle of doing my makeup so my hairstylist um her name is Brittany. uh she is slayed.studios on instagram she came over earlier today and recurled my hair for me and pin curled it up she also cut some layers in it to kind of frame my face so that my natural hair blends in better um at first it was all kind of one length so yeah shout out to her and definitely give her a follow on instagram slay studio she's also uh she also does all of my braids here in miami as well so if you have liked any of my braid styles um not the knotless like super long braids she doesn't do those i get those done in new york city and harlem uh but yeah anything else you've seen me have she's done it for me uh, my goddess braid she literally does everything she does weave she does braids she has her own studio so yeah if you're in the miami area check her out i will link her down below and i will put her instagram handle here slade.studios check her out so yeah i just took it out and it look, it's looking so full and nice and so I'm just doing a quick face because I want to film a little content today. I have some products in from brands that I want to show you all. And it's going to be a busy like work day today. Um, by the way, I've already told you guys about this uh, foundation. It's Beauty Counter Skin Twin. You guys know I already love Beauty Counter because it's clean makeup and I love their... Um, skin do uh tinted moisturizer but i've been looking for a little something with more coverage uh, especially that's going to get me through like the humidity <laughs> of florida miami um and this is just so good i have been absolutely loving it the coverage is pretty flexible um and it's just so good i wonder is this vegan as well like i think all of their products are clean but i mean the coverage is, it gives me it's giving like just beautiful skin and then for my under eye i've been using this this is my new favorite concealer i did try the makeup by mario and that one's good as well but this one is even better this is by rose ink um and it's i believe it's vegan or clean and this just works out so well it keeps my under eye from creasing it just gives me a nice youthful like glow like oh i'm awake <laughs> type of vibe Again, using this little pad from Amazon. I got a pack of these. I'll link these down below to apply some Laura Mercier translucent powder. So the last, this last week has been so busy. I've literally been running from event to event to event, but I know that the rest of the year is going to be like this. This is quarter four for us. And, and, and as a content creator and influencer, this is the busiest time of year with the holidays and all the brands that want to get their holiday looks and products out there to the masses. And they are coming to content creators to do that. So I've just been working so hard. And then I have my own clothing line with something by Sanji launching at the end of this month as well. Uh, if you are subscribed to my newsletter, y'all already know when the collection is dropping. So save your coins because it's going to be good and you guys are going to love it. I'm actually heading to LA next weekend to shoot the collection with Sanji and it should be fun. I got an invite to a party <laughs> next weekend in LA um, and so I'm really excited. Uh, of course, I'm going to vlog it for you guys and I'm heading home for Thanksgiving with my family in North Carolina. I usually don't show my family, but I might actually vlog a little bit. I don't know. I'm still very protective of my family, and I don't know. We'll see, you guys. We'll see how I feel. I think one of my nieces made it into <laughs> one of my vlogs last time I was home. Yeah. So look how beautiful and, like, matte. And, like, this does give me, like, a yellow under eye, which I normally don't do, but I do have a yellow um undertone so it kind of works out when i even everything out so i'm just going to finish up my makeup and then i'll check back in with you guys i'll show you what i got from um the tata harper event 
skincare event and also her skincare brand is clean as well you guys know i'm trying to really switch over all of my skincare and beauty products to either vegan or clean products uh, because as much as i do my makeup and put things on my skin i want it to be like non-toxic so we are working on that so i'm going to show you what i got from that um i'll also do a little recap of the event with else yellow my second time going in like a week i think you guys saw it in the previous vlog where I, where, I, where i went to dinner there um and then i have a bunch of new things in i have let's see some skincare from road i have some jewelry in from edge of ember uh just a bunch of things so i'm going to show you guys some new in items that i think you will love so i'll check back in in a moment all right guys finished my makeup got myself together i'm loving the hair with the layers uh i'll be sure to link um the hair down below as well as my stylist and i think the next time i'm gonna have less leave out because y'all i can't be dealing with leave out not in miami um okay so let's get into some products that i got in I'll end with the Tata Harper uh, pieces, but I got some good stuff and I have some Lake and Sky. I have some Parfum du Marly. Uh, so let's get into it. We'll do a, a super quick unboxing. Okay, so we are going to start with Lake and Sky. I have been loving their 1111 fragrance. Actually, today is 1111, so fitting. Um, and I'll put a lot of you on to 1111 as well. Um, they are an artisan like lifestyle brand with fragrances and candles and a very like modern very minimalist uh, aesthetic so they sent over their 1111 azure i hope i'm saying that correctly if not you can see the spelling there um and this is very similar to their other 1111 fragrance it says blue skies azure waters inspired by the sheer power and boundless energy of the ocean 1111 azure is an aquatic take on the 1111 fragrance with notes of water accord lotus blossom blue amber and musk and uh let's take it out of course and we're going to do a first impression together so i love their bottles they're just so clean and simplistic super nice just like their 11 11 fragrance all right so first impressions Ooh. it's definitely giving like light oceanic very clean that's the word clean Ooh, this reminds me of something very very clean i i love it this is really nice for like everyday wear too it's not like overpowering it's like someone would just walk past you and you won't even be thinking and they'll be like wait what's that hmm it has a little like je ne sais quoi about it very nonchalant but fresh aquatic with a subtle like muskiness i love it that blue amber i can definitely smell the blue amber coming through and the musk and the lotus blossom everything just flows very well if you like light fresh fragrances with a hint of like amber and musk this is for you i'll be sure to link it below they come in different sizes and different price points uh so yeah check it out i think the big bottle is like 90 something dollars but they go down in sizes and the prices go down as well so if you want something artisan check that out in addition to sending the fragrance they also sent this lake and sky discovery set so if any of you are interested in checking out like all of their fragrances you can get this discovery set i'm gonna open it up but I will also link it down below. This would be like a great gift for the holidays. I wouldn't suggest buying someone a fragrance for the holidays unless you know that they already love that fragrance. But gifting them something like a discovery set where they can choose 
they're able to explore all of the different fragrances i think that's a better like gift um all of these fragrances are unisex vegan cruelty free um they are modern and conscious beauty designed to elevate and enhance every day and we have all of their fragrances here oh that's very cool so they have 1111 1111 azure um, Apare Midnight 07, Saffron Dusk sounds amazing, and Santal Grey, which I have a Santal Grey candle from them, which I love. So yeah, I'll link this down below. They also sent, and I didn't even know that they had all of these products, but they sent their Orange Blossom and Bergamot Body Butter. Y'all know I love a body butter. And I love how just clean and aesthetic all of their like packaging is. Look at this. Ooh, I love that orange blossom. Let's see if it's, it looks super creamy. Yeah. Wow. That orange blossom is coming through. This is like giving the tropics, you know, like a Jamaica, Barbados, mm, Tahiti type of vibes. And very moisturizing and yeah, takes away the ash. We love that for us. They gave me a little rollerball is this a rollerball or is this a spray of the 1111 so uh like i said it does come in different sizes for different price points so if you just want to try it they have the little mini spray capsules as well and it is a spray it's not a rollerball so yeah if you just want to try it you don't want to go for the big bottle or spend as much money you can get the smaller bottles and then they also sent the orange blossom body exfoliant I love how everything looks. It's just clean and white. It's the same as the moisturizer, but it's an exfoliant. So shout out to Lake and Sky for sending these over. And I will be sure to link them down below. Okay, next up, I have a little something from my friends over at Edge of Ember. I love their jewelry, um, especially all of the collaborations they do with content creator Victoria, Victoria McGrath. Um, here on YouTube, Instagram, all the places. I, I, I just adore her. Uh, but they sent over a little something. I love their boxes. They're just very holiday-esque. Um, so if you're looking for a good jewelry gift for people this holiday season, definitely check out Edge of Ember. I'll link a few pieces I own from them below, as well as some I think would be great for holiday gifts. But look at this. So they sent over this gold necklace with initials and i ended up getting the initials m and s hopefully you can see that in gold and it's just so like elegant and and chic i love like the the way the letters actually look now this gold chain has these little gold baubles as well uh, and you can also just get like one letter or three letters. The letters are kind of separate. You can get as many as you want. And I got this length of chain. You can also decide the length of the chain as well. Because I think this would be great for stacking. So if you have kids and you want to get their initials for like every kid. Or you want to get this for someone special in your life. The price on this is amazing and they're always having beautiful sales as well can you see like all of the little gold baubles there uh love and again i can't just take one off and have like one initial but just so gorgeous so shout out to edge of ember uh, they say let your jewelry do the talking and they create luxury pieces with positive production story designed to look good and do good so yeah, shout out to Edge of Ember for sending me this. I do own some earrings from them as well as I believe another necklace. Yes, I own another necklace from them with pearl. Um, and it's just very unique and, and minimalist and beautiful. So if you're looking for jewelry to give someone this holiday season, I'll link this necklace and the initials down below. Of course, they come in like the whole alphabet. And also some other pieces I think would be great gifts for the holiday season from Edge of Ember. 
All right, guys, next we have a little home decor something something from my friends over at Nest. And I think this will be perfect for the holiday season if you're looking to, you know, make it festive around your home without like buying decor. You can make it festive around your home with home fragrances. So this is the Nest New York Holiday Read Diffuser and Candle. And I've already smelled this, you guys. It smells exactly like Christmas, like pine trees. Um, uh, I can already smell it. And I'm kind of in the holiday spirit already. <laughs> so I'm kind of, you know, decorating around my house, um, mainly with scents. To, and like flowers, like red flowers, deeper colors of flowers to get that holiday festive feeling even here in a warm weather location like Miami. But this is the aroma of a sparkling holiday season created by blending pomegranate, mandarin orange, pine, cloves, uh, cinnamon, and a hint of vanilla and amber. Okay, so if you're looking for the perfect holiday candle that just smells like, it literally smells like Christmas. Uh, check this one out and i love the candle it's so beautiful it's like gold and of course the candle is white so beautiful aesthetic that will go wonderful with your holiday christmas decor or whatever holiday you celebrate oh it smells so good let me show you what the reed diffuser looks like and i've actually just you know started getting into reed diffusers this year um and I have quite a bit from Nest that I have around my house already. But let's, let me show you this one. It, it has that same holiday feel. It's very like clear. It looks almost like wrapping paper in gold with just a clear bottle. Ugh. And then of course their reed sticks are always black, which I appreciate because when you have a white reed stick, once it starts to get old, it turns yellow and that that's not visually appealing. So I like that they have black reed sticks. So that's the holiday candle and reed diffuser. And they also sent another one, which I think is also wonderful for the holiday. If you don't like like that pine smell, like the smell of a tree, um, they have this one. This is amber and incense and it comes in this beautiful black and silver box. I got the reed diffuser and I also got the candle. So the notes on this is rich notes of crisp amber, frankincense, and aromatic cedar offer an exotic take on ancient traditions. So the candle looks very similar to the holiday candle except for it has like little dots all over it in silver. I think I like this one. Ooh, the amber comes through so strong. I love it. Ooh, it almost smells like a burning fire with amber. Wow, okay, out of the holiday one and this one, this one's my favorite. Uh, and again, the reed diffuser looks very similar. So shout out to Nest for sending these. If you're looking to gift someone for the holidays, I feel like these will make great gifts, especially like the reed diffuser because many people aren't up on reed diffusers. I mean, if people, if the people in your life love a candle, then the candles work too. But I feel like the reed diffusers are just so aesthetic. This is the amber and incense one. Uh, I'm going to maybe go ahead and put these out, the amber and incense. And I think I'm going to take the holiday ones home uh, to my mom for Thanksgiving. I think she'll love these. So a special thanks to my Nest fam for always, you know, keeping your girl in mind. I do love a candle. And finally, we have a little something from Parfum de Marly. Um, I've heard amazing things about this perfume brand, but I don't own any of the fragrances. So I'm really happy that they sent these two fragrances over. Um, they are quite pricey but in case you're looking to try it i want to give you guys the first impressions so first up the packaging is gorgeous i love these shiny black boxes and the emblem from 1743 we're gonna start with a uh, safonade which wow i wish i had <laughs> the notes um if i can find them i'll put them up on the screen um but 
Look how gorgeous this bottle is. It is absolutely beautiful. Ugh, so gorgeous. Um, so let's let's smell. I need to find a new wrist because we already sprayed the 1111 Azure here. The dry down is impeccable. Okay, let's start with Safanade. It is, it smells a little ambery. Ooh. Ooh. This is given like mystical, faraway lands. Rich, very, very rich. You know, you bathe in, in, in amber. You had your body scrubbed in a deep essence uh it, it's it's giving me like egypt moroccan like it's giving me african royalty this is what it's smelling like although <laughs> it was produced it says uh, the elegant and refined fragrance company renews the splendor of 18th century through its original concept when the greatest perfumes were created for king louis in tribute to the prestigious horse races he fervently admired and initiated. Well, <laughs> well, this smells like African royalty. That's all I can like. I feel like this is a perfume that like Nefertiti would wear, you know? Yeah, that's what it's giving. And the bottle is so stunning. Wow. I normally don't go for fragrances like this. It's It smells super like to transporting you back to when they went to the very source to to create a fragrance i love that wow and the bottle is so beautiful um so this is from the royal essence collection and this is safanade i hope i'm pronouncing that correctly okay next up we have athalia now this is also black but this is matte the other one is shiny if you can see the difference um, so let's, oh wow, so the bottle is a matte black bottle with a cute little tassel and a gold top just like the other one. I'll put the notes on screen here for Athalia. First impressions, let's move it somewhere else, let's see there. Okay, she the one. I love this. This is like perfect for the holidays too. Not that it smells like Christmas or anything. It just has a very deep enveloping, like it's like a warm hug. Ooh, I, ooh, I really like the, out of the two, I like this one more. I mean, the other one smells amazing as well, but I've literally never smelled anything that smells like this. There's some kind of pepper in this too. It's, it's deep it's mysterious it's it's warm without being like childish warm it feels like a, like a warm hug uh i love athalia amazing so i'll link these two below if you want more on the fragrance notes and, and everything just click the link um it should take you straight to the fragrance where you can experience all of the notes and such Oh, I just got a text message. Um, I'll be right back. My Uber Eats is here and I'm starving. All right, you guys. So a special thanks to Parfum de Marley for sending those over. I cannot wait to experience them during the holiday seasons and create some core memories. Um, so yeah, the other day we did go to the Tata Harper event and they did let us uh, keep these gorgeous little like key balls. And I love that it has a handle. It has Tata Harper on the front. You would have seen it yesterday when I went to the event at Casa Tua. But inside it has a mirror and then there's just space for you to put your makeup in. So I think this would be great for like traveling if you're traveling with a lot of makeup. Or if you just have an extended stay because this is quite heavy for you to put all of your makeup in and then have a nice mirror to do your makeup. Uh, they also gave me some of the waterlock moisturizer which is one of the products that i really enjoyed using um, when we did our skincare lesson yesterday 
and it was just super moisturizing it almost feels like a jelly and i had never quite experienced anything like it is this the one that i use let's see let's see i love how everything is refillable too oh this is the moisturizer the moisturizer okay the water lock moisturizer is amazing as well so i went home with that and they also sent us home with this little gift set and in here everything of theirs is green because it is a, a clean skincare and beauty brand they sent us with the whole entire skincare collection so we have the restorative eye cream this oil is so good this is a um complex multi-action oil remember after you do your skincare do your whole skincare routine and end with an oil because oil is a sealant it locks everything in um then we have this is what i loved this is the resurfacing mask for an instant glow and it's almost like a little jelly this is probably my favorite product out of the whole skincare line as you can see i've used it <laughs> but uh amazing love this stuff um yeah and we just have miniatures of all of the skincare products their cleanser as well as their reparative moisturizer. Everything is glass, refillable, wonderful clean skin care brand. And they also gave us this deep clean kit. It's a double cleanse routine. You guys already know, I triple cleanse my skin after wearing any kind of makeup, even if it's clean makeup, um, to really get the pores clean. So they don't get clogged, it doesn't cause acne. Um, but they have this great double cleanse a kit so i'll be sure to link all of these things down below if you're looking for a clean a clean green beauty brand try saying that three times in a row and shout out to them for inviting me to their event all right guys my food is here so we're gonna head down and eat i'll show you my usual order from sweet green i have a new order you guys know i usually get the crispy rice and like baked chicken salad and that is still so good, especially if you have that dill like sauce, the green goddess sauce. But I've been getting something else and I love, I mean the flavors of it together is just so good. So I'll show you guys what I normally eat, we're gonna eat. And then I'm gonna show you some tech stuff that I've gotten in um, that I think you all will enjoy. I did get a new MacBook Pro, so I'm gonna show you that. And then I got some accessories for my vlog camera. So yeah, let's go eat and then we'll get into some tech things. All right guys, so I already lit my amber incense candle from Nest and it smells so amazing. I also went ahead and assembled my reed diffuser here. Uh, so anytime I step into the stairwell, it just smells incredible. I love how it looks as well. My little stool, my little family moment here. And I'm really feeling the big luscious hair with the curls. It's kind of giving. Also loving my new necklace from Edge of Ember. By the way, the dress is Skims. It's always Skims. Okay, so here is my order from Sweet Green. I got the hot honey chicken. And you guys, it is so good. So it comes with chicken. It comes with a uh, quinoa. Um, it comes with uh, potatoes, sweet potatoes, and a little bit of like like coleslaw almost. But it's this sauce for me. It's like a hot honey mustard, and I literally just drench it all over and just eat everything like together. There's also some crispy onions in here as well. But mm, I mean, it doesn't look like much, but it's delicious. So definitely let your girl know if you end up trying it. I'm gonna see what's new on YouTube, eat my lunch, and then I'll show you guys some new in tech. Oh my goodness. And this is actually hot. Like, they're not playing. There is red hot pepper in this. eating my lunch it was delicious my favorite thing from sweet green 
I'm also in a new house dress. This one is from Wolford and their collaboration with Numero Bente Uno. Um, you can get it at my Teresa. I'm wearing a medium. It's one of my favorite little house dresses, travel dresses, lounge dresses. Um, but yeah, I changed because I just shot some reels, some fashion get ready with me's for the week that I think you all will enjoy. So hopefully you're watching my YouTube shorts. Um, and if you're looking for details on the outfits, just click the shop my outfits link in my bio. Um, oh, I just got a text message. Anywho, I wanted to show you guys some equipment that I got from Amazon for my vlog camera. Again, I vlog with the Canon G7X Mark II. I've linked it down below if you're interested. Um, but they have these cool little covers for your cameras. Um, and I <laughs> saw this one and I loved it. Literally, it's just like a little rubber cover. And what I do love is that for the lens, this kind of pops out so it can work with your lens if your lens wants to zoom out zoom in it's really really cool and again it has all of the little button detailing as well so you can kind of customize your vlog camera and also if you drop it this will kind of help to protect it as well but not as much the viewfinder which is the glass portion that shows the picture of yourself um i ended up getting these which are um um g7x mark ii screen protectors water water and anti-dust protectors so i managed to like see these while i was looking for the covers and i was like you know what the last camera i had i it shattered the glass and so i had to get a new one because it's touch screen and i was like cutting my finger trying to do things so it's really great that they have glass protectors and i'll try and pull one out for you guys i think there's three or four that comes in this pack for the viewfinders so I'll just stick this right here on this viewfinder and it'll protect it just like an iPhone. So if you are looking for accessories for your vlog camera, if you're a vlogger, I'll link these down below. I got this from Amazon for like 12 bucks and these were maybe like $6 for a pack of like five, I believe. So yeah, very happy to have these. If you want to know what apps I use to create content with other equipment I use to create my content please watch my most recent day in the life video um I list out all the content I use my tripod my camera my camera for photos my light like literally everything that I use um and I will also just go ahead and link all of my equipment that I use down below in the description bar as well and in addition to that I did get a new MacBook Pro um my other MacBook it's maybe like two or three years old, but it doesn't have the little connecting buttons anymore, but I guess they put them back on, which is great because I was tired of lugging around an external plug that I had to put my SD card in to plug things in to charge. Like it was too much. So I got the 13. Is this 13? Um, this is the new like M3. Look, I don't know anything about technology, but this is my new computer. And I also bought the little cover to go with it, the little uh, like acrylic plastic cover. And I haven't really used it yet, but <laughs> so far I love it. It is heavier than my old MacBook, um, but this has more space. And actually my old MacBook is like full. Um, and it's probably from video editing, even though I don't actually edit my videos with that laptop. Um, just importing the photos and then dropping them to a Dropbox little by little takes up memory even though like I delete them right after they're uploaded and I use an external hard drive for saving videos. It's just that computer has been through a lot and I needed a new one so happy to have this. Next up I'll probably get the latest iPhone. People are clowning me because I have the iPhone 14 but I still only have two cameras so anytime I post a selfie they're like really? Really? You only have two? Really? And I'm like yes! Like I'm always kind of late to getting new phones because there's always issues when they release a brand new one, like it overheating, which is a problem with the brand new iPhone. So I'm waiting till they resolve the issues before I get a new one. Anywho, you guys, I believe that is going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, I think this might be a quicker video. Um, but I do want to shout out Veronica Beard for sponsoring today's video. Again, if you are looking for stunning holiday dresses, I will be sure to link 
all of my favorites including these two that i showed you guys before in the description box below um they are really true to size i'm a u.s size six i got a size six in both dresses they fit perfectly so just go with your normal size and you will probably see this beautiful crushed like velvet golden green dress soon because i'm going to new york and i am going to an event where i'll be heading to the ballet and i just think this will be so beautiful for the ballet uh so yeah shout out to veronica beer for sponsoring a portion of today's video all right guys so that is it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you did please make sure to give me a thumbs up it helps me out so much um, if you all just want to show love, you can do it by just thumbsing up the videos. It helps to push my videos out to more people. We're aiming for 200,000 by the end of the year. I know it's a lofty goal, but I think we can do it. You know, share, comment, like, subscribe. Um, and if you haven't yet, click the notification bell so that you never miss a video. Again, I've linked everything you've seen in today's video down below in the description box. Please use my links. It helps me out with the brands. Um, and thank you guys so much. Just... This week has been crazy and you guys have been showing me so much love like in the comments on all of the videos. I read every comment by the way, um, as well as over on my Instagram. And it just, it means a lot to me, especially when I'm like working, working so hard. I got the most incredible voice note from a longtime subscriber um, who I consider like family at this point. Like we talk about everything, <laughs> about everything. Um, and it made me cry because uh, he had been going through a tough time and he just let me know just by showing up and creating just you know fun easy breezy content that it like gave him something to look forward to and it inspired him and like things like that that they just it just it means a lot to me i know that being a content creator isn't the most i don't want to say like glamorous because it is glamorous but in terms of what it's doing to like physically help people it's kind of unseen the how we help people and you really don't know until like you receive those kind of comments so yeah shout out to him and thank you you know who you are thank you for praying for me and thank you i love all of y'all i really do and i appreciate you all so much please do not forget to subscribe to my newsletter because i'm doing giveaways twice a week probably for the rest of the year and we are giving away a chanel bag in december so please subscribe there's a link down below thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you all in the next one bye guys